Hey, Scooby Lover here, and welcome back to Scooby Doo <laughs> Mystery Mayhem. Let's go. Oh, you go first, Waggy. Like you want to go first? Right, come back quickly, Scoob, and bring me back a sandwich, would you? Oh, we do. Key to open the store. Can I climb this? Yes, I can. Right, roller rise. Oh no, it's a boulder, guys. I just hope they don't throw whole tree at me. <laughs> Look, Scoob, there's some kind of drawing on this wall. What is it? Beats me. Looks like some kind of switch with a number over it. Hmm. One second. All right, we're back. the other door. Sorry, hold you guys. I don't have time for you. Anybody got time for you? Want climb it, please. Thank you. And you are now open.
like I'm a ghost wrangler. Get I'm here. Get over here. Like another one. Clue. Alright. Let's continue. I want to write some of these down. Like, whoa! I need the castle yard key. Whoa! Crazy ghost! Yikes. Ouch. Place to go. Open the castle gate and explore Studio A. you ghost. Come here. Come here. There you are. Rug, school. Oh, I like it was so scared. I almost lost my appetite. Almost. <laughs> like that, man. Like that ghost in toast. I want to check back here. Maybe I forgot something. I'll go off that ladder later. Oh, a castle! They're always full of ghosts! Rose? Oh. <laughs> Oops! Key. Wait, can I go down here? 
And no, it doesn't seem like it. Clues, looking for them, collecting clues, looking for them. Thank you. 
Monster Rocket. Your turn. Careful, Scoob. I'm a ham. Zoinks! Hey, Scoob, you're back. Go in front, Raggy. so long. Need to look around for clues. There's one right there. Like, look what I found, Scoob. Oh, we do. L1. I'm talking to myself. Tooth. 
I know it's actually pronounced lettuce, but I just felt like saying it weird. Don't hate on me. going down. Hey! And like this is some kind of electrical room. <laughs> and that sounds like one nasty shock over there. <laughs> eh, puns. Poltergeist page, yes. Now I can finally catch you. See where I'm going. But I hope I'm going the right way. <laughs> I think I did. <laughs> hey there! Huh? Shaggy, did you see that walking suit of armor? See it? Like it snatched up Scooby. We gotta save him. Great! I'll catch it all on film. <laughs> yeah, like if it doesn't catch us first. <laughs> Save Scooby first. Great, you found a clue. I can't. I've got to save Scooby first. I can go in this one now. <laughs> Mommy. Run! 
I don't have the page for mummies. Okay, now scared. Paging Mr. Mummy. Blue. Oh man, you're a natural. Why, thanks. Okay, now look scared. Like, ah. I'm scared. Scooby, Raggy. Hey, what am I? Chopped liver? Hmm. <laughs> Chopped <Chop> liver. <laughs> Shaggy, look up there. There must be a way to use that crane to lift up Scooby's cage. Try to reach the control panel. Like there must be a way to lift this cage. Shaggy, try to reach the crane's control. Come on, Shaggy. Get Scooby out so he can get the key. Brother's not gonna like this. Oh, Zoinks! Mommy! Camera. <laughs> Sometimes when I play, I forget to breathe, <laughs> and uh, whenever I do, my system does a great job of reminding me that I need to breathe by exhaling sharply like that. <laughs> oh, there's something over there. Scared. Like, I am scared. I found the French mustard. So I need two more to go. Looks like I need cheese and an egg. Okay, now look nervous. Like, I am nervous. and the fuse and the gear. This motor is out of order, man. Not quite sure what to say to that.
like there's a valve handle missing here. There's a lot of stuff missing. Red Knight probably took it. Thing over there, I can't quite see. There might be a way to, uh, to get rid of the chains or extend the bridge. If there is a bridge.
<coughs> breathe, breathe, Scooby Lover, breathe. on the other side. Stay in the frame. Mummy page, yes. Come here. Uh, I'm out of juice. Find ones. Oh, ah, this is gonna suck. Go!
do it again with peeling. I got the fuse and the gear. Now it's time to get beer. Hmm. I can actually say that now. I'm legal. <laughs> I turned 22 recently. <laughs> it was my birthday about a week, two weeks ago. I tend to keep things like this to me. Hello. Mm -hmm. I got a mummy. Actually, I can do this. Come over here, Mr. Mummy. I want to get you in the book. <laughs> I just need to go back in here. Go up the stairs. Got all the stuff. That's free Scooby. Scooby Dooby Doo! There you go, Scoob. Ah, that's so touching. Now go find my key. Shaggy, look out! <laughs> Scoob, I bet you he won't be showing his face around here anytime soon. Zoinks! Well, will you look at that? Like I think we just found ourselves a clue. Jeepers, what happened? Like the Red Knight just brought down half the Roman Empire. Shaggy, please tell me you've got the key. Well, it, uh, actually... Well, don't just stand there. Go get it. <laughs> Guys, come on. I can't hang around here all day. Well, actually, I guess I could. Cage key. Scoob! Like I was oh, so you wagon. I almost lost my appetite. Almost. <laughs> Welcome. 
Hey, you did it! Like, of course! Yeah, of course! Okay, now let's go find the others. A good idea, I'll go with you. Meanwhile, you can take care of those mummies. M -m 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 mummies What's he talking about? Yikes! <laughs> You're not going anywhere, bandage face! Or set to go. Like you want to go first? Seat for a bottle of expensive cologne from a big department store. This is a crumpled picture of Earl Milton. 
It looks like someone doesn't like him. These look like mummy bandages. From a fake mummy. These are too new to be the real thing. This is a picture of some kind of Western-themed amusement park. This oversized helmet was probably used in the Milton's medieval epic. It smells like expensive cologne. Scooby, Shaggy, there you are! I told them all about your cool rescue skills. Don't worry, it's all in here. Real dynamite stuff. So, did you two find any clues? Way to go, guys. At least we know there's someone inside that armor. Meanwhile, Doug has disappeared. Hmm, that's interesting. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you suggesting... I'm not suggesting anything. What else did you find? Well, we did find more pages from the Tome of Doom. Chinkies! Shaggy, Scooby, do you guys realize what this means? <laughs> like it means we're starving. <laughs> We're so hungry, we're down to eating props. No, it means that there's a link to the library case. Jeepers. Don't worry, gang, I've got a plan. Okay, let's run through this one more time. You guys find the knight and trick him into running after you. Then I'll open the drawbridge, and he'll follow you into the sci-fi set. Daphne, Velma, and Earl will take it from there. Any questions? Yeah, do we have to? <laughs> Why are you two scared? This time you know that it's a fake monster. And like that's supposed to make me less scared? Who goes running around in a suit of armor? <laughs> Come on, guys, you'll do fine. He's gaining on us! Run, Scooby! Run! He's gaining on us! Run, Raggy. Raggy, the ridge. Oh man, the bridge is still up. Hmm. Prepare for defeat. <laughs> Zoinks, keep running, Scoob. You can't get away. Faster, Scoob. He's right behind us. Raggy. is one big hassle. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Well, that didn't work. You can run, but you cannot hide. Run, Raggy! One more lap! Come hither! Why doesn't he ever get tired? He's getting closer. Why doesn't he ever get tired? Run, 
Raggy! Why doesn't he ever get tired? Zoinks! Now what? Aha! Like, finally! Ruby doo Now! Let's see who's under that helmet. Er, box. Robert Zabrinsky. I should have known that cat was up to no good. Walter Peabody must have sent him pages from the Tome of Doom to scare away your cast and crew. Knowing that this would force you to sell. And I would have gotten away with it too if it hadn't been for you meddling kids and your pesky dog. How did you figure it out? Well, Shaggy and Scooby's clues steered us in the right direction, but the real clincher was the helmet. Its oversized shape was perfect for the image-conscious Zabrinsky, who could wear it without messing up his impeccable hair. But what about my bro? I'm over here! Zabrinsky ambushed me and wrapped me in these... You scoundrel! Have you any idea how much these mummy costumes cost? That was some great detective work. Even better than in the Big Nap or Death on the Rhine. Say, have any of you ever thought of being in pictures? You know, you'd make a great damsel in distress. Well, now that you mention it, what about me? Uh, well, we always need riders. And what about us? Like, can we do the catering? <laughs> Actually, I had something better in mind. And action! <laughs> like, isn't this the best of happy endings, Scoob, old pal? Scooby dooby doo! Episode 3, Weird Wild West. I see. No, just stay where you are and await further instructions. Zabrinsky's been caught. The fool! I always knew he was the weak link. Any news from Peabody? As far as I know, he hasn't told the police anything. Then we move on with the plan. Where are we off to now, Freddy? The Gold Mountain Western Theme Park. Groovy! You hear that, Scoob? Before you know it, we'll be eating Western chili and Western barbecue. Western omelets? Western omelets? Sure thing, pal. <laughs> it turns out that the same creepy guy who was trying to buy the Milton Brothers movie studio was also trying to buy Gold Mountain. Let me guess, their property is also being haunted by monsters? Yep. Someone there must have pages from the Tome of Doom as well. More monsters? Well, their plan worked. I'm scared. Let's go back. Uh -huh. Well, if you chicken out, that means no Western-style barbecue. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Chicken, chicken barbecue. barbecue. <laughs> Howdy. I'm Johnny Chaniapatra, and I want to personally welcome you all to Gourd Mountain. Jeepers, this is some ghost town you have here, Mr. Chenaya Patra. Dad, blast it! This ain't supposed to be no darn ghost town! It's supposed to be a rustle and bustle and western theme park. Can I help it if all the darn monsters keep scaring away the folks? Don't worry, sir. We'll get rid of all your ghostly problems. I'd be much obliged, partner. See, I put all of my life savings into this doggone place. What about your employees? They are all gone except for one. Oh, here she comes. Allow me to introduce my only faithful employee, Mindy Stiles. She plays bit parts in the Wild West show, as well as being security chief, accountant, marketing manager, and the best darn chef this side of the Rio Grande. Like did he say, chef? Scoob, old pal, I think I'm in love. <laughs> uh, Mr. Chenaya Patra, I need you to sign some insurance papers. 
Ugh, blasted paperwork. Well, y'all just feel free to explore. All right, guys. We'll split up and look for clues. Shaggy, Scooby, you investigate the hotel. Hotel? Know what that means, Scoob? Room service! <laughs> That'll do it for this episode. An episode per episode sounds good. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Till next time, this is Scooby Lover, signing off. Stay sharp.